Oh, we? Thank you. Morning, Joanna. Morning, Dr. Collier. Ah, Desmond. Hi. Have the rats tried that yet? Come and see. Good dog. Progressing down to zero. The more you put in the cage, the more they cuddle up. Well, well. You'll get the Nobel Prize. For peace, if not for chemistry. But you're no use to me tonight. I'm dining at all souls. I'll need all the aggression I can muster. You certainly will if Matthew Hallett's there. Science should be a collaborative process, Desmond, not a competition. In theory, perhaps. But anti-aging research is a rat race. Come on, James. Alice a jealous sod, and he hates my gut. And as Oxford pharmaceutical products hang on his every word, I'd really rather he knew as little about this as possible until the presentation on Tuesday. All right? Well, come on, I was up till dawn this morning, keeping ahead of the field. Yes, well, about that. I'll lock up. Promise. But this is the third time, Desmond. I mean, we're bloody lucky no addict tried the door. What time did you really leave here? About midnight. And I've said I'm sorry to everyone 999 times. And I'm sorry to you. Why don't you go and get drunk at All Souls, and I'll struggle on with my desperately dangerous drugs. Well, the Chambon time is pretty remarkable. Don't get it while it's hot. All right. Good night. Good night. I'm so sorry. Your mother's made such progress as well. She, uh, I mean, before she would hardly have known who you were talking about, would she? Well, would you like me to go with you, or perhaps Matron? No. We'll manage, Keith and I. I am sorry. I can't win, can you? I've cured their senility. I've given back heartache. I can thread a needle. Look! I might even take up needlework again. I used to be very good with cushions. A couple of months ago, that old lady could barely feed herself. Really? Very impressive. Thank you, Dr. Hallett. I'm afraid I always seem to be cast as the wet blanket on these occasions. And uh, it does occur to me that these nootropic drugs... Sirenix, is it? Seraphix. And I have trademarked the name. Very well. Seraphix. They are new. They could hardly be otherwise. I've only just invented them. <laughs> My point is Dr. Collier is testing these drugs entirely in accordance with the proper guidelines. Of course, I wouldn't dream of suggesting anything else. But he is testing them on old people. They are designed for old people. We have to be very careful about committing ourselves to a drug whose long-term effects are, by definition, impossible to discover. Ethically, that is. And as businessmen, well, I don't think I have to remind anyone here of a certain anti-inflammatory drug There's... or of the size of the compensation payments that had to be paid. There's no similarity whatever, really, Hallett. You know that as well as I do. In my view, no responsible pharmaceutical company can commit itself to seraphics till much greater research has been completed.
You always leave the front door open. Always. Just in case by any sad mischance, something exciting should escape the lab and be found on unlicensed premises. No alibi like pleading guilty to another offence, eh, Mike? It is Mike, isn't it? So, what can I do for you at 3 a.m.? I've had the police round. Not for the first time, I imagine. Hang on to that. Don't worry, we'll bite. Promise. There's a girl who went missing after Saturday night. Yeah, well, girls have always gone missing. I also think a kid may have killed himself. Why? Well, I don't know. They think there may be two kids. Suicide pact? They wanted to know about the drugs. What did you tell her? funny about last Saturday's mix, was there? Did you think there was? No, but two kids. Look, the whole point of my drug is that it makes you happy without getting carried away, right? Yeah. Yeah, it's great. Well, but... There is no but. This is a totally butless drug. If the police weren't so stupid, I could explain it to them. What a drag. This next party's the last of the year. They're gonna try and stop it, aren't they? I don't know about it, I don't think. Well, there you are, then. What are you worried about? Let's make it a good one, eh? What's the matter? Don't you believe me? I think I'll wait till the party. Do it yourself. Do you understand what I'm saying to you, Charlie? Yes, I do, dear. The man came to my workplace. No. He came to my lap, for God's sake! Right, then. So there's just leave just to it. Him out I better leave a note. What for? Well, he went not know where I've gone. <laughs> Vicky, he's in the studio today. He's not even going to remember you were here. Come on. We're not going to go to jail, are we? Well, we're not going to go to jail because you're going to keep your bloody mouth shut. But what would a 17-year-old boy want with an anti-aging drug? Well, whenever people's memories start to go, it's often not enough oxygen getting to the brain. So Dr. Collier has devised... Seraphics. Dilate the capillaries to uh, increase the oxygen uptake. If a person with normal capillaries were to take it, they would uh, probably get a, a terrific high. I would have thought more uh, uh, a feeling of extreme clear-headedness. Is it like what kids take, then, before exams? No. no it's quite different. Could it do them harm? No. Well, it hasn't been tested on youngsters, of course. The young do have a much more volatile psychosusceptibility. <laughs> Sudden surges of extra oxygen to the brain might, well... Might it depress you? Like you want to take your own life? The opposite. I mean, not that this boy gave it time to work. Couldn't have affected him at all. I wouldn't have thought the amount he got before he... Well, uh... if it's so new, this drug, how would he have got to know about it? Well, <laughs> it's like this. Since this pill is going to change the lives of every old person in the world, the... Research labs are dying to get their hands on my formula. And since my entire future depends on their not getting it, I um, left the lab unlocked on Saturday night. <laughs> Classic Freudian slip. But I spend all of Sunday afternoon, most of Monday, counting the pills, and I'm almost positive there's none missing. Almost. Well, we do endless variants trying to find the right mix. And if someone ran in here, grabbed a handful and ran out again. <laughs> what can I tell you? Won't happen again. I promise.
Away. 